Good afternoon. I'm introing today from Lake Eola. The boys are at home. I am swinging by here to pick up some lunch, some extremely special lunch. Guys. Here it is. I found it. It's the Portillo's bus. Oh my goodness. So this is the temperature and everybody's shaking in their boots because this is Florida, not Chicago. All right, the, the, a special live stream of DVC's 30th anniversary is going on. I'm so happy to be here with you. And thank you for playing that particular song. But today is all about looking forward with hope and optimism. And for me, there's nothing in the Disney songbook that captures so that. So this spirit. is going to be real Quite cool. Like there's a great big beautiful tomorrow. So. 30 years of DVC. It is so strange listening to this VP of Sales for North America for DVC talk about timeshare using the vernacular of the business, of the industry, because that's what I work in. So it's strange to hear her talk about tour rates and all of that and what they changed during COVID and why. So it was cool. This is definitely, it's just, this was advertised for members. Um, I think it's open for anybody to watch, but it's streaming today. It's for the 30th and anniversary. And I think yeah, Voices of Liberty are going to be on this later and, and some other things. But we're waiting for Mom to get back with the Portillos for our lunch. Look who joined them. Broadway star, greatest showman, actress, beautiful, beautiful singer. Which reminds me, we have to add you to our deed, sir. Oh my goodness. We got two dipped beefs with hot peppers. We got two everything hot dogs. Pop. Fries, cheese sauce. I was so nervous they weren't gonna let us like have the beefs be dipped, but like I should have known to trust Portillo's that that was a part of the menu. Peter, you had three options like dry, wet, which is like the Portillo's way, and then dipped, which is like full on dunk, which hot is dipped. hot dipped. Yeah, and I, I was just nervous that it wasn't gonna like. We weren't gonna be able to customize it the well, way we want. Portillo's if you didn't, if they didn't let I you know, but it was just so nervous. What are you watching? The streaming special for the 30th anniversary for DVC, and this is, I think it's members only, but I'm not sure. All it was was an email, and I hit watch now. Cool. But it's super cool so far. They're at the Atlantic Dance Hall. They make it look good. They, uh, this whole thing's called We Go On. <laughs> Sarah's crying. They just announced that uh, she's gonna sing We Go On with Voices of Liberty. Air Huts, we're gonna record this special for you. First verse, and I heard. And our dreams, you can't even say it now, <laughs> begin another thousand circles around the sun. And I thought immediately about each and every one of us, not just nationally, but <laughs> internationally, hoping for another tomorrow that we get to try it in again with, in a better way, not only as us being able to stay alive, but better as individuals to actually be able to come together in a more positive way and so i just started crying i just of, of course which is not new again these are also songs that have they, they tell stories Ha <laughs> ha 
Wow. Hi, Evie girl. Is it your birthday tomorrow? Yeah. Evie turns four tomorrow. So we made it into Hollywood Studios with a half hour of park time. Slinky Dog has a really low weight and Peter needs to change dames. So we figured I would go and ride Slinky Dog because I've really only been on it like, I really only think I've either been on it once or twice. So I'm gonna ride it. That's our priority tonight. We're probably gonna head over to Crescent Lake after, but for now we have split up and I am out of breath. <laughs> I'm Sheriff Woody. Come on in and let's have ourselves a root tootin' good time. I got the baby. I got the baby. We're going to Launch Bay to meet all the characters. Oh, wait. You don't meet anybody there anymore. Sorry. Also, we literally walked in the park. What time is it? 20 minutes to close. We were gonna try to ride or swap Slinky because Sarah hasn't been on Slinky in forever. I don't think I have either, but it's more important Sarah gets on it. So James had not the greatest ride here, but he signaled that he needed a diaper change right as we were getting into parking. So now of course he's sweetly asleep in this car seat, but I don't want him sleeping in a dirty diaper. So Sarah's gonna go wait in line for Slinky. I'm gonna go wait, or I'm gonna take him to the companion bathroom here by Launch Bay. Cause I love using companion bathrooms. And then we're just going to walk around, peruse while we wait for Sarah and then probably leave and go to Crescent Lake afterwards because this park closes at 7. We're at the club. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, rock on. He is not thrilled right now. He was cozy asleep and I just had to change his diaper, you know, and ruin the mood. But... We're chilling, we're relaxing. I don't know, Jamesy. Mom might put it, might, might put on that slinky. She texted me and said I'm about to get on. Thanks for letting me go on that ride. Yeah, thank you. It was a perfect amount of time to change James, try to get him to calm down by the Vampirina stage. That didn't work. Uh, we might have watched you on it. We might have. And it, now... It's crazy. That's a crazy coaster. It was good. I only waited like 15 minutes. You literally got off at 7.01. Yeah. Do you want to take the long ride out? The scenic crowd? If they'll let us? Galaxy's Edge. At night! We just watched that Mandalorian season 2, so now I'm like all in the mood. <laughs> we have not been here at night. Uh, I don't think in 2021. Ha! <laughs> I don't think we have until I don't think either. since before <laughs> COVID. Yeah, before COVID. Yeah. Definitely. Still takes your breath away. Oh yeah. Skyliner baby. Skyliner city. Going? We're going uh We're about to be swim, swim dolphin, get crazy. Oh we're not going to swan a dolphin. <laughs> well, we're gonna keep our fingers crossed that James stays asleep. I'm gonna rock him a little bit. 
wonder what there's a movie on the strong. Oh, we're going to well, Crescent Lake. I think Boardwalk is Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Should we like just say, you know what, let's just see if Flying Fish has an opening? Oh gosh. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Woo. welcome aboard the Disney Skyliner at Disney's Hollywood Studios. Happy 30th anniversary, DVC! For this just being the hub, it's so beautiful! <gasps> We're in a real life Pixar movie. We are. I want to scratch an A in front of that. So if you weren't aware about that Pixar reference, a lot of the like founding members of Pixar and animators they took classes in a classroom that was A113. I think a lot of that Disney animators too, so. Yeah. It's in, it's in older movies too. Right, and I think it was like the Academy for Animators that Walt started, I think. Yeah. Cal Arts. Cal Arts. Okay, quick before I'm interrupted again. A lot of Pixar movies will have A113 hidden. Um, most notably, I think it's the license plate for the Pizza Planet truck in Toy Story. Um, so yeah, keep an eye out on it. We may or may not be coming here just for the smells and the bathroom. Listen, I had a lot of coffee today. Listen, I love this Listen, resort. Listen, I just want to check in. You know how <laughs> many times so I just want to go here. to the front desk and be like, what's your best rate? Give me the Ben Earhart special. <laughs> Give me it. When I worked at the Marriott, JW Marriott Chicago, if I was checking in Ben Earhart, he would definitely get a, an upgrade from me. We did have a lot of fun when we stayed here. Was that this, sum this summer? This past summer? Yeah. It was our first time staying here. Isn't that cool? It was such a good time. We had so many snacks. Oh yeah, Movies and Anastasia just started. Yeah. And it is 101 Dalmatians. I actually think I could hear it. We got it. <laughs> We're in the gift shop of the Beach Club. And we haven't been there since they up updated the, the whole quick service area. I know, we're gonna have to eat that. Um, they also have like baked mac and cheese. That you can enhance with bacon or pulled pork or plant-based chili. It was really, really delicious. Uh, mac and cheese? Yeah. Best resort on Disney property. Resort area? Yeah. Yeah, we love it here. <laughs> And um, our camera died, so yes. we're on the phone. But at least we're using a slinky iPhone 12. Is that what you got? Yeah, I think I have the baby. Check on him. Still sleeping. Good. I heard that. He's still sleeping. It's a little chilly tonight with this breeze. It's below 60. But I think the parks are mellow right now. I won't say low or empty or slow. I'll just say mellow, because look at this. It's 8.30. Granted, I know things are closing earlier right now, but. This is, this is the boardwalk. This is the boardwalk. This is the place to be. You know how I miss? Chris. Well, yeah. But. <laughs> Chris. Chris, Coney Island Chris. Coney Island Chris. Yeah. Um, that is a monster of a chocolate. Twist. Trying to eyeball half-sy-dabsy. Eat it all one bite. I'm just joking. <laughs> it does look very sticky. Here's the cookie, by the way. Better look. Look at those chips. It looks like a, it's definitely a different kind of cookie than anywhere else on property. How is it? Mm. Mm. I told Sarah, if we have enough money in our Disney Disney Visa Rewards account, I'm about to look it up because we never use it, to buy a pizza, we'll buy a whole pizza. And she's like, don't tempt me with a good time. So we'll see if the book routes are getting ridiculous. Well, <laughs> <laughs> It worked out that we had exactly the right amount of rewards. How magical. I didn't plan this, I swear, but I'm loving every minute of it. Check it out, check it out, check it out. Oh boy, pizza's here. Ooh. Oh, we went pepperoni. I started salivating the second we opened that up. So I just told Sarah, I said, you know what though, with what we just did, I know it seems ridiculous with the fact that that's going to hurt our stomachs, with the fact that we already had Portillo's, which was hurting our stomachs. But here's the thing, I'll never look back at the last month of us living here and say, I really regret getting that pepperoni pizza to that random Thursday night at the boardwalk. So. Neither will I. Yeah, so we're just, we're doing what we want for this last month. Okay, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> I 
feel like he's really angry. <laughs> Just like quiet mad. Which is arguably one of the worst kinds of mad. Yeah. Did you guys want no secret? That's the most kind of like whenever I get mad, I'm I'm like a quiet I'm like a quiet mad. <laughs> but I don't get mad often, right? No. But you do feel your feelings. Like when you are mad, you're very mad. I wear my emotions on my sleeves. But like okay. He gets me. Yeah. But like when you're really happy, you're really happy. When you're sad, you're really sad. Oh, goodness sakes. Wait. It's midnight, so it's Evie's birthday. Be sure to say happy birthday to Evie in the comments. January 28th. The world breaks everyone, and afterwards many are strong at the broken places. Ernest Hemingway. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are, we know what we hope to accomplish, and believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.